brutal cold and snow. Winter's calling card here in the northern states. This weather often comes courtesy of Canada and the cleverly named Alberta Clipper, Saskatchewan Screamer, and Manitoba Mauler. And you know, with names like that, they aren't bringing any wimpy weather. So let's show you where these intimidating storms get their start. Over here in the Pacific Ocean, moist air drives inland and heads for the Canadian Rockies. Here, it collides with cold mountain air. That cold air then spills downslope into the plains and low pressure begins to form. And this is the part where people in the U.S. really need to start paying attention. The low catches a ride on the jet stream and shoots into the U.S. When a storm originates in Alberta, it's known as an Alberta Clipper, named after the fast sailing ships of the 19th century. When it forms in Saskatchewan, it's known as a Saskatchewan Screamer. But if it waits to get its act together until Manitoba, it's a Manitoba Mauler. Because these systems ride the jet stream, they're usually quick hitters, bringing frigid temperatures and howling winds, but often just one to three inches of snow for cities from Fargo, North Dakota to Minneapolis, Minnesota. Now, despite the lack of heavy snow, the wicked winds that accompany these Canadian-born storms can create dangerous ground blizzards, bringing everything to a halt. And these storms can often move farther east into the Ohio Valley and the Mid-Atlantic. So no matter which frightening name it gets, the Clipper, the Screamer, and the Mauler can bring some serious weather to the U.S.